The McFarlands are said to be descended from Gilchrist, a younger son of Maldowan, Earl of Lennox. They derived the surname of McFarlane from a grandson of Duncan, son of Maldowan, who was called in Gaelic, Parlan or Bartholomew. The son of Parlan was called Malcolm McFarlane, Mac, meaning son, in Gaelic, who may therefore be considered as the real founder of the clan. On the death of Malcolm's son Duncan, the ancient line of the Earls of Lennox became extinct. The McFarlands claimed the earldom as male heirs, which was disputed by the feudal heirs, and in the contest for what they considered their just rights they suffered severely, and only escaped total ruin by the assistance of one Andrew McFarlane, who had become connected with Lord Darnley and Earl of Lennox by marriage. Through his aid they succeeded in recovering their possessions. From this time the McFarlands became strong supporters of the Earls of Lennox of the Stuart race, and we find them in the subsequent history of Scotland taking an active part in the civil wars of the 16th century, being at one time marshalled on the side of the supporters of the royal cause against Oliver Cromwell, and at another on that of the enemies of Queen Mary. The family of Macfarlane is now nearly extinct. Its principal seat was Arakar, at the head of Loch Long.